Hi everyone! If you are looking for a fast, easy and most of all free of charge way to take screenshots on your Acer laptop, your search is over. Because in today's episode we'll cover how to take screenshots on an Acer laptop. You're probably familiar with the standard method with the print screen button. It's a very common method, but it comes with lots of limitations. You can only capture your whole screen and if you want to send your screenshot to someone, you will need to browse it on your laptop and send it as an attachment. So to save you a lot of time, I will suggest you use one of the best apps for screen capturing called ScreenRec. With this amazing and easy to use tool, you can select the region you want to capture and even add some annotations. This will definitely come very handy to make your screenshot as informative as possible. So let's see how it works. The first thing you need to do is go to ScreenRec.com and download the app. Installation is very quick and takes no more than 2 minutes. Once you start the program, make sure you create a free account to use all the great features this app has. Otherwise, you will be limited to a 5-minute recording and you won't be able to use the instant sharing option. But more on that in just a minute. Once you have installed ScreenRec, press Alt plus S or the camera button on the floating ribbon to activate the app. Choose the area you want to capture by dragging your mouse. If you want to capture the full screen, just drag from one corner to the opposite. Now you have selected your area, you can annotate your screenshot if you want. You can add comments, shapes and text. And here comes the big and significant difference with the simple print screen option. You can download it locally on your Acer laptop, use the instant shareable link and send it directly in an email or message, or copy the image to the clipboard and again paste it wherever you like. That's it! Taking screenshots on your Acer laptop can be very easy when you have the right software. That was all for today, guys. I hope this tutorial was useful to you. And if it was, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more great content. Thanks for watching.